Hello YouTubers and welcome back to my kitchen. Today I will show you how to make zucchini fritters. A delightful starter that sometimes it's not so tasty, sometimes it's very oily, sometimes it's not so aromatic. Today I will show you the best way to cook them. They are very crunchy and light and trust me guys, you only need 5-6 ingredients, a lot of love and you will have the best fritters you ever tried. And let's begin. Uh, we have to prepare the zucchini and we need a bowl and a thin kitchen towel. Line the bowl with a kitchen towel. Grate 500 grams of zucchini using the large blade. Sprinkle with a generous amount of salt. Wrap them in the towel and squeeze very tight to release as much liquid as possible. This is the most important part of the recipe. Extracting as much moisture from the zucchini as possible will ensure that your fritters turn light and crunchy. Transfer the zucchini to a bowl. Thinly slice two spring onions, only the green parts, and add them to the bowl. Finely chop one bunch of mint, only the leaves and add it to the bowl. Finely chop one third of a bunch of a dill and add it to the bowl. Finely chop one bunch of basil and add it to the bowl. The grated zest of two limes, one level teaspoon of ground cumin, two pinches of chili flakes, crumble 200 grams of feta cheese and two eggs. Mix until all of the ingredients are completely combined. Add 80 grams of all-purpose flour and stir just to combine. Do not overmix. As you can see, I add very little flour inside the mixer. We don't want uh, the mixer to stiffen because after it will become very oily, it will soak up a lot of oil while it's cooking. We want to be light, fluffy, crispy and full of flavors. Place a non-stick pan over medium to high heat. Add two to three tablespoons of olive oil. Pick up spoonfuls of the zucchini mixer and carefully add it to the hot oil. Don't burn yourself guys, press down on the patties very gently, just to spread them out a little. When they turn golden on the first side, flip them over and fry on the other side until golden and crunchy. Cook them just like you would cook pancakes. Transfer them to a pan lined with paper towels, so they can drain from any excess oil. Now it's time to prepare the dipping sauce. I have added 200 grams of Greek strain yogurt to a bowl. Add one heaping tablespoon of honey, a level teaspoon of ground cumin, salt and freshly ground pepper. Stir and your refreshing dipping sauce is ready. Serve this delicious full flavored zucchini fritters with the yogurt dipping sauce. Sprinkle with some chili flakes, some fresh coriander and some lime wedges. And there they are! They look and smell amazing! Crunchy on the outside, soft on the inside and not oily or greasy at all. And the dipping sauce is also light and refreshing. It is the perfect combination for the fritters. And now I will cut and try my fritters. What can I say for this amazing starter? Uh, truly, you can feel everything inside the fritters. You can feel the dill, the mint, the lime. But the star of this fritter is zucchini. We add very little flour inside the mixer, so the zucchini flavor is the star uh, of the whole dish. Uh, it's totally balanced with the sauce. The sauce is amazing. You have to try uh, the combination with the fritter and the sauce. It's something you have to try. And if you like it, you have to subscribe to my channel, make comments underneath the video, share with your friends, and uh, what else? That's it. 
See you next time. Bye bye. Γεια σας.